As the final comic book movie of the year, Aquaman and the Lost Kingdom has landed with its early box office projections, and it's not a pretty picture. These reports, courtesy of Box Office, paint a dismal forecast for the movie's arrival. We're looking at an estimated 32 to 42 million opening, a staggering decline from its previous expectations. Remember, earlier speculations pegged this sequel as a potential $1.8 billion blockbuster, with a projected $200 million opening. However, the reality is drastically different, a more than 75% plunge. There are various factors at play here, contributing to this downward trend. From the industry strikes to the controversy surrounding the film and its star, Amber Heard, this movie was battling an uphill struggle from the start. It seems audiences are disinterested in the DC universe, and many might not even be aware of this film's existence. It's a different landscape for movies now, with numerous releases facing disappointment due to various external factors. The question now is, what happens next? The fate of Aquaman might be decided by its opening weekend numbers. If it falls under $100 million, it's in trouble. Under $75 million, it's dire. And less than $50 million might signal the end of the road for this aquatic superhero. While I fear for the future of Aquaman, part of me feels it's already endured its fair share of challenges in live-action adaptations. Perhaps a break and a proper reinvention could serve the franchise well. Stay tuned as we navigate the twists and turns of this box office saga.